Louisiana Beer Review Squatters. Juicy India Pale Ale, Citrus Melon, Dank, Fruity. Fruity. Squatters from the Utah Brewers Alliance. This is from Utah. This IPA is 4% alcohol. Hey, really? A 4% India Pale Ale? All right. Mm-hmm. It's not even listed on their website. Good grief. Enjoy by July 18th, 2019. It's got a, a enjoy by me, guys, but I don't see a, a born on date. Squatters founded in 1989. Okay, so it's saying fresh, a fresh squeezed glass of hazy deliciousness. <clears throat> Packed with bright citrus aromas and notes of ripe stone fruit. This unfiltered Northeast IPA from the West <laughs> finishes smooth, creamy, and pulp. Free. So a, a Northeast India Pale Ale from the Mountain West. Great Beer has one rating. Beer Advocate has one rating. Untapped has 788 as of the time of this recording. And they're giving it a 73 out of 100. That's pretty good for untapped. Okay, the sun is kind of at a bad angle up there. It's 80 degrees. 83 degrees, okay. Kind of a soapy white head, very white. And a, and a lemon yellow appearance, gold yellow with the sun shining through it. Lemon yellow with the sun shining on all that batter. <laughs> All right. It smells juicy. Stone fruit. Okay. I have some stone fruit on that very tree. <sighs> and you get the white bread. The white bread cross. You've heard me say that so many times with these ales. Too much wind. Hey, but you know it doesn't really taste too fruity. It tastes pretty watery. It's like tap water. Nothing bad. I mean, you know, good tap water. Utah mountain tap water. High mountain water. It's very prickly carbonation. It's almost like a fizziness in the mouth. Maybe some white wheat bread. Forget the bitterness. They're talking about what? Dank. <laughs> this thing is not dank. It's opaque. See, you probably won't be able to hear it over that wind, but that fizz is like too much. No, you won't hear it. I don't know, man. I've had a good number of New England IPAs. They never tasted like this. It's unusually fizzy. It seems absent of most flavor. It's not bitter. It's not... Well, there's a little bitterness. There's... There's not a... I know that... I know what you're going to say. Not as any IPA or... Yeah, N Northeastern or New England. It's a fruity. It's, it's a juice bomb. Yeah, this one's more like a tap water bomb. I like tap water. I drink tap water. I like Utah for the most part. And I've enjoyed Squatter's beers for the most part. But today, this thing is flopping. Maybe they took it off the website. Or maybe they're just testing it out. And then maybe they decide, eh. Hey, look, 4%, that doesn't really rate as an India Paleo. I don't know what the IBUs are. A 9, an 8, a 6, a 5, a 0. It's warming up out here, so you could go up and down. I think with all this thickness, though, the calorie count might be kind of high. Um... 
it's like marginally okay. I'll say a C minus, a 70 out of 100, 7 out of 10. You know what I mean? So, this is a good time to, they're cutting up trees, so people don't ask me. They just decide, hey, it's the weekend. Let's do yard work. Don't bother checking to see if he is doing beer reviews. <laughs> um, I better hurry up and finish this because it might turn into a D. It might go to a D, which would be 60 to 69. C would be 70 to 79. So I'm saying it's a marginal C and only marginal. So, uh, yikes. Well, ugh. but yeah, it's on the cusp of me saying it tastes bad. All right. So y'all come on. Y'all come on down to Southeastern Louisiana.